friends today is Monday that means we start our Monday video 15 minutes watercolor sketches this time we combine two tools together this and that I have a one photo for the reference I took it in Mexico last year so I'm going to use this but I don't want to prepare the sketch by pencil. Today we will talk about the spontaneous painting. It's kind of different style and I very like it for the sketching process. I'm gonna use my echo palette and just a few colors. Queen Gridon Deep Gold, Alizarin Crimson, Indigo and uh, Tallow green blue shade. When I say spontaneous painting, I mean a lot of touching made without control, with a loose and freedom, just like that. And uh, I like to use my favorite special effect. Don't worry, we do not produce the abstract painting. Finally, it will be something pretty realistic stuff. But for my, for my opinion, that's real spirit of the sketch and of watercolor. I can tell you why. Idea is I'm not trying to 100% control what I'm doing. I left the big part of the job to the watercolor and the watercolor make a lot of things for me. That means it's a great relationship. We are in combination. Something made just watercolor itself something trying to do myself and uh, I'm not trying to push the watercolor uh, I'm trying to fall in that if something nice happens I'm starting to use it that's I called good relationship like usual I use the high quality paper in my sketchbook that's why you know it's not drying fast and I have a time to play with the combination of the colors which is very comfortable and just a little bit trees So I can say I prepared my background, I can stop on that. If you're painting outside, that's drying extremely fast because of the windy sunlight or something. Here in the studio I have a good, good weather inside, so I have to use the, the machine to save our time. And that's another one chance to make something dynamic and fresh.
Well, we have a pretty nice silhouette and a very interesting game with the colors. And for now, we are starting to care about the graphic design on top of that and care about the shapes. But it's very important. Do not try to put something completely different on top of that or just follow in the photo. We have to follow in that. For now, we have this. This was created by me and watercolor together so we have to respect it i mean if i want to put some design on top of that i have to use what we already have here and just make some parts a little bit more interesting or more understandable and be delicate don't make it over sketching or over painted Like usual, if you have a chance to show the perspective better, we're going to use that chance to make the, the lines go into the varnishing point. I like that sound. So I can say it's almost done, because uh, I'm following the very simple rule. If I explain my subject, if it's look like understandable, but not exactly absolutely clear, if I left the big part uh, for the people who look at my painting for imagination, give a chance to rebuild my picture, that means we're working together too, and that's great. So if that look understandable, not 100%, remember, and we can recognize the place and explain it. That's all what we need.
So we make that sketch very fast, simple and almost from nothing. So the step the steps is in the beginning use the spontaneous style. We create the silhouette and play with the colors and use the strikes and nice touching to make our background look loose and life and freshness. After that we use that tool, the pen, to make the nice design on top. And like you know this is a special pen, it's pen mixing with the water. So we can after that take the water and uh, make some shadows if we want. For this painting it's not necessary, but if you feel what you miss the contrast and want to make something darker, you see that possible. Just use the clear water and you can make the darker accents. But for my feeling, special for this sketch, it's absolutely not necessary. But if you want, you can finish it like that. Thank you very much for watching. All the uh, materials what I'm using today, uh, like uh, much more videos and tips and advice, you can find on my website watercolouronline.com. Thank you, see you next week and be safe.